Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to another episode of Dragon Age Inquisition. Here we have our elf warrior sword and shield bearer as it were. Uh, apparently I need to report to the Haven's Chantry even though they sent me back out here and now I need to go back in. Alright that's fine. Does it trouble you? Didn't close the breach, not anymore. I want a gun, it's fine. Where does it come from? It stopped spreading and it doesn't hurt. We take our victories where we can. What's important is that your mark is now stable, as is the breach. You've given us time, and Solas believes a second attempt might succeed, provided the mark has more power. The same level of power used to open the breach in the first place. That is not easy to come by. Sounds like fun. Yeah, sounds like fun. We'll be comedic about it. What harm could there be in powering up something we barely understand? Hold on to that sense of humor. You've met Commander Cullen, leader of the Inquisition's forces. It was only for a moment on the field. I'm pleased you survived. This is Lady Josephine Montelier, our ambassador and chief diplomat. Anderan Atishan. You speak Elven. You've just heard the entirety of it, I'm afraid. And of course, you know Sister Liliana. My position here involves a degree of... She is our spymaster. Yes, tactfully put, Cassandra. Pleasure, impressive titles, why am I here? No, we'll say a pleasure, we'll be nice. Pleased to meet you all. I mentioned that your mark needs more power to close the breach for good. Which means we must approach the rebel mages for help. And I still disagree. The Templars could serve just as well. <sighs> we need power, Commander. Enough magic poured into that mark. Might destroy us all. Templars could suppress the breach, weaken it, so... Pure speculation. I was a Templar. I know what they're capable of. Unfortunately, neither group will even speak to us yet. The Chantry has denounced the Inquisition, and you specifically. That was quick. Yeah, we'll we'll. Keep that didn't take day. long. Shouldn't they be busy arguing over who's going to become divine? Some are calling you, a Dalish elf, the Herald of Andraste. That frightens the Chantry. The remaining clerics have declared it blasphemy, and we heretics for harboring you. Chancellor Roderick's doing, no doubt. It limits our options. Approaching the Majors or Templars for help is currently out of the question. The Herald of Andraste... Could we be attacked? So I'm the problem. The Breach doesn't worry them. Uh... Yeah, what's the Herald Just of Andraste? Just how am I the Herald of Andraste? People saw what you did at the Temple. How you stopped the Breach from growing. They have also heard about the woman seen in the rift when we first found you. They believe that was Andraste. Even if we tried to stop that view from spreading. Which we have not. The point is, everyone is talking about you. It's quite the title, isn't it? How do you feel about that? I like it, it's unnerving, I don't know, they're wrong. I'll say I like it. I don't mind it at all. People are desperate for a sign of hope. For some, you're that sign. And to others, a symbol of everything that's gone wrong. The breach doesn't worry them. They aren't more concerned about the breach? The real threat? They do know it's a threat, they just don't think we can stop it. The Chantry is telling everyone you'll make it worse. There is something you can do. 
A Chantry cleric by the name of Mother Giselle has asked to speak to you. She is not far and knows those involved far better than I. Her assistance could be invaluable. I'll talk to her. I'll see what she has to say. You will find Mother Giselle tending to the wounded in the hinterlands near Redcliffe. Look for other opportunities to expand the Inquisition's influence while you're there. We need agents to extend our reach beyond this valley, and you're better suited than anyone to recruit them. In the meantime, let's think of other options. I won't leave this all to the Herald. Oh, quest map time. Ooh, this is exciting. You'll find when uh, people are talking, I try not to talk over them, because I do want to hear what they're saying, and I'm sure you all do as well, so... The war table allows you to apply the power of the Inquisition to Rome. Orleus and Ferelden. Mother Giselle is in the hinterlands, which can be found on the Ferelden side of the table. The Inquisition can unlock areas for you to explore through scouting operations. Perform the scouting operations for the hinterlands on the Ferelden side of the war table now. Any word? Nothing yet. Yeah, I'll assume it's this one. Yeah, let's go there. Power cost one, so basically I have to send the spy right now, but it looks like I can send the forces or my uh my ambassador of connections or whatever she's called but I have to inspire right now so I'll do that to gather your party and venture to the hinterlands now. Yeah, sure. We will bring Varric with us. Cassandra and of course Solus. Confirm that. And let's be on our way. Oh, this game is so pretty. I love it. Loading, loading, loading. Ugh, I wish my PS4 was just a bit faster. Herald of Andraste. I've heard the stories. Everyone has. We know what you did at the breach. It's odd for a Dalish elf to care what happens to anyone else, but you'll get no back talk here. That's a promise. Inquisition Scout Harding, at your service. I, well, all of us here, we'll do whatever we can to help. <laughs> Harding, huh? Ever been to Kirkwall's High Town? I can't say I have. Why? You'd be Harding and I... No, <laughs> never mind. Ugh. Pleased to meet you. You heard stories about me. What's the word out there? 
Yeah, I'll go what's the word out there, keep things official. What's the situation out here in the hinterlands? We came to secure horses from Redcliffe's old horse master. I grew up here. And people always said that Dennett's herds were the strongest and the fastest this side of the Frostbacks. But with the Mage Templar fighting getting worse, we couldn't get to Dennett. Maker only knows if he's even still alive. Mother Giselle's at the crossroads helping refugees and the wounded. Our latest reports say that the war's spread there too. Corporal Vale and our men are doing what they can to help protect the people, but they won't be able to hold out very long. You best get going. No time to lose. What are you? This might interest you, sir. What is it? See for yourself, sir. I won't do that right now, but I will do that eventually. Ah, uh, we'll rest. I'm not sure what that'll do, but I'm sure it'll do something. Let's just jump off course. Watch your step. Mother Giselle should be somewhere nearby. Inquisition forces! They're trying to protect the refugees. Looks like they could use a hand. Oh. Kill that warrior! Hold! We are not apostates. I do not think they care, Seeker. We are not Templars. You know, huh? Doesn't look like they're listening. That was Coming our way. I have no idea where I'm supposed to go here. Quest map. Ah.
That's the end of it. Oh, okay. I just had to beat the forces. That'd be a really cool tattoo. There are mages here who can heal your wounds. Lie still. Don't... Don't touch me, Mother. Their magic is... Turn to noble purpose. Their magic is surely no more evil than your blade. What? Hush, dear boy. Allow them to ease your suffering. Mother Giselle? I am. And you must be the one they are calling the Herald of Andraste. You asked for I'm me. told you asked for me. I know of the Chantry's denouncement, and I am familiar with those behind it. I won't lie to you. Some of them are grandstanding, hoping to increase their chances of becoming the new divine. Some are simply terrified. So many good people, senselessly taken from us. What oh, happened was God, horrible. Really. Fear makes us desperate, but hopefully not beyond reason. Go to them. Convince the remaining clerics you are no demon to be feared. They have heard only frightful tales of you. Give them something else to believe. Appeal to them? You want me to appeal to them? If I thought you were incapable, I wouldn't suggest it. Will they even listen? Let me put it this way. You needn't convince them all. You just need some of them to doubt. Their power is the unified voice. Take that from them, and you receive the time you need. It's good of you to do this. I honestly don't know if you've been touched by fate, or sent to help us, but I hope. Hope is what we need now. The people will listen to your rallying call, as they will listen to no other. You could build the Inquisition into a force that will deliver us, or destroy us. I will go to Haven and provide Sister Leliana the names of those in the Chantry who will be amenable to a gathering. It is not much, but I will do whatever I can. Cool, so now we have her as an ally, which is nice. Allies are good in the whole point of... Uh, Corporal Vale up. is coordinating the Inquisition's efforts in the area. We should speak with him. Thank you for cutting me off, Cassandra. Uh, you know, you allies are good when you're building up a force to be reckoned with. But honestly, I, I, I really do wonder who actually killed the Divine. It's, it's going to be an interesting thing to find out, I think. Oh, well, I have to go... You're up. with the Inquisition. Corporal Vale, thanks for your help. Later, then. Go away. You're with the Inquisition. Corporal Vale, thanks for your help. The Majors and Templars don't seem to care who gets caught in their war. The refugees here are in dire need of help. If the war doesn't kill them, cold or starvation will. Concerned about refugees starving? Yes. Many of them brought food, but they expected to be home by now, or safe in a city. There's a hunter up the hill who had some ideas. Is there anything we can do to help people deal with the cold? 
I asked the Inquisition to send blankets. You'd think I was asking for a wagon of raw lyrium. A recruit named Whittle is trying to make what we can bring in last. If you have any ideas, talk to him across the road. What other problems do these refugees face? We've got some injuries that go beyond stitches and elf fruit. I know healers are in short supply. But if you can find someone in Redcliffe to help us, it would save a lot of lives. What can you tell me about the man who's supposed to be getting horses for the Inquisition? Horsemaster Dennett. He lives on a farm to the west. Tough old fella. We haven't heard from him. Best we can tell, he's old up until the Majors and Templars are done killing each other. What can you tell me about the Rebel Mages? The real Rebels are up north in Redcliffe, dug in and taking care of their own. The ones out here are just apostates, locked up in the circles all these years, and now they've gone mad with power. The Rebels in Redcliffe have washed their hands of them. I wish we could do the same. What can you tell me about the Templars? All the Templars were called to Val Royo not long ago. These bastards ignored the order. Now they're killing rebel mages, along with any refugees they think are mage sympathizers. Every Templar I've ever known has wanted to protect the common folk. These men defile their order's good name. Farewell. And you as well. Stabilize areas by sewing. Dealing fade rifts, expand the reach of the Inquisition by setting up new camps, and complete quests to gain power and influence. Spend power on scouting operations at the war, at the war table to unlock more opportunities. Gaining enough influence increases the rank in your Inquisition and grants you access to unique perks. Quest map. What do I want to follow? First of all, we'll s make this a camp. Wait a minute. Is that the one I already own? <coughs> yeah. We'll set up this camp first, and then we'll do some more. So obviously the Hinterlands is a very big area. So I may not be able to finish the Hinterlands in one episode, just the rendering of the last one took four hours almost, and then upload took two and a half. So I kind of want to make sure I get this up within a reasonable amount of time, so I might keep episodes a little shorter. I just wanted to get a prologue done last time so we can delve into the actual game here. This would make a good place to camp. Set up camp. By creating camps I expand my Nothing reach, report, so that's what I'm gonna try and do in this episode, just like find camping locations and set up as many as possible. Because as you see there I got my power up one. Quest map. Where else can I go? That's main story, which I can do and I probably will do. So that's one rift. That's another. So because I'm all the way over, where am I? So I'm here, which makes me actually closer to here. So do that. Scavenge some elf root.
Hopefully the Inquisition can find some way to help these people. Okay, you need this training? Yeah, okay. <laughs> Later then. So we'll get these two rifts closed and then we'll continue doing stuff. Ah, but we're right here, so I'm also going to grab whatever this is. Eric, get out of there. a quest here or so. Oh, it's probably inside here. Hello? There appears to be a quest right where I'm standing, but I can't exactly find it. Well, I guess we're not doing that right now, but that's okay. Kill the ram. Get back on top right here. I just wanted to get some ram leather. I'm not gonna worry about it too too much though. Cause I kinda went way out of my way on that. taken care of. I 
and then the next rift is over here. have fled to the hills. Construction is progressing well in Kirkwall. I know things are bad there. I wasn't trying to. You weren't trying to remind me how bad it is in Kirkwall, so you decided to talk about it? About its recovery. What you're talking about are the buildings, and even that will take years. People don't recover so easily. What? I closed another rift. What are you telling me, that I didn't actually close it? Ugh, oh, well that is annoying. We'll head over this way, because Horse Master Dennett is here. So actually, we'll go to this one. And then we can set up the camp here, heal up there, and then take that quest and then move around and do the rest of the camps, I think. Actually, I'm gonna rest up here at this camp first, because that'll probably give me back my health potions that I use. Not up. everybody, and then you can just... Look. That's the King's Road down there. 
Look at this. The apostates have gone mad with... The Templars aren't looking any better here. Only restore order by securing an alliance. <laughs> do 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 do. travel to the tent thing. No. Now we will go here, establish this camp, go to Horse Master Den and do his quest, and then where am I? So I need to head
gotta do that. I'm not worrying myself with that right now. These things you have to. Just make sure I'm... I've been walking in the wrong direction the whole time. I'm just gonna run away from these guys because I really just want to do the main stuff. Just keep going, just keep going, just keep going, go, go. Do, 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 do. Cut across the river here. Do you kind of attack me first, so you know. No normal wolf would fight with such determination. The breach may have driven them mad, or perhaps a demon took command of the pack. I just leveled up to level four. Weapon and shield upgrade to a lungeon slash, I guess. <gasps> or I can get shield wall. <gasps> yeah, let's get shield wall here. And then we'll also get bear malls the wolves. Using techniques perfected <laughs> by Orlson, you can't be flanked by enemies, and you're less likely to be staggered when hit from the front. Oh wait, I guess I should, you know. Do this to everyone.
Sunbreak, that was Cassandra, now Solid. Make camp here. So that means I have five power already. That's awesome. Now we need to go to my quest map and go to Master of Horses. Oh, you're right here. This must be Master Dennett. Must be something here. So you're the Inquisition, eh? Here you're trying to bring order back. It's high time someone did. Never thought it'd be a Haller rider from the Wildlands, though. Name's Dennett. I served Arl Eamon for 30 years as Horsemaster. I hear your Inquisition is looking for mounts. That's it is. Where. Can you help us? Not at the moment. I can't just send a hundred of the finest horses in Ferelden down the road like you send a letter. Every bandit between here and Haven would be on them like flies on crap. You'll have mounts once I know they won't end up as a cold winter's breakfast. I'm sure the Inquisition has plenty of time to win the confidence of a retired stable hand. Yes, and then this retired stable hand will get you some real horses instead of the crowbait you've got now. My wife Elena manages the farms and Bron's in charge of my guards. They'll tell you what they need. Until then, you deserve something better than whatever knock-kneed plowneck they gave you. The chestnut over there is a purebred Ferelden forder. Take care of him, and he'll take care of you, Inquisition. heard what my man said. If you want our horses, then we need our farmers back safe in their fields. Since the breach appeared, the wolves have gone mad. They come after our men like beasts with the water sickness. You deal with the wolves, and our farmers will be safe again. How are these wolves acting differently from normal? Normal wolves go after livestock, but come at them with a torch and a blade and they run. These beasts, though, it it's like darkspawn during the blight, or when the dead rose to attack us. They're possessed, or something like it. I've lost too many men to the beasts. I won't endanger more. Farewell. Good day to you.
The master doesn't want me handing those refugees weapons until they've got any hope of defending themselves. If you put up a few watchtowers, we'd all have more warning before the next attack. You said you had a way to help the refugees. I do. There are too many hills in these parts, good places for raiders and bandits to gather. I've marked good spots on the map. You set up watchtowers there, I'll talk to the master and get your people weapons. Farewell. Shouldn't we travel to Val Royo now, Seeker? The breach isn't going to close itself. Indeed. The sooner we obtain help for the breach, the better. Alright guys, I know I didn't do too too much today, but that does it for this episode of Dragon Age Inquisition. When we get back, we will probably do the watchtowers and take care of the wolves so that we can get weapons and horses for the inquisition uh which is something we're probably really gonna need uh so we'll do that and uh hopefully finish all the other quests that are kind of on my sidebar right now but anyway that does it for this episode i will see all of you on the flip side until then stay awesome stay wacky have a wonderful day. Bye-bye for now.